Hello and welcome back to Exploring Your Eye Identity with AGW. This is a video series. So here's a quick recap. Hi, my name is Ala Al Barbari and together we explored the different parts of our art identity. We talked about our personality and our actions. If you'd like to learn more, go watch those videos. For today, we're going to explore our last part of our art identity, our ideas. So what is our ideas? Our ideas are what we are naturally drawn to, our creative impulses. And like we said before, each part of our art identity is surrounded by questions that answer and define it. The questions that surround each part are unique to it. Personality has personal perspective questions, action have project-based questions and action questions, or our ABCs. And lastly, our ideas, and they have self-discovery questions, which are the heart of our creative identity because the answer to them feed directly into our personality and our actions. So, what are self-discovery questions? Self-discovery questions are in line with what we are naturally drawn to and reflect our creative impulses. They can be ambiguous or specific. The questions you ask, how deep you ask them, and what direction you take them is what really define you as a creative. So if I gave two artists the task of coming up with an imaginary language, one might ask more questions about how it sounds and how it's pronounced, while other might ask more questions about how it's written and how it's viewed. This is just a simple example of the questions you ask and how deep you ask them are really what define you as a creative, because these are the questions that you gravitate towards the most. To know what we gravitate towards, sometimes we need to know what we run away from. To explore that a little bit more, let's go to our first activity of the day, waste. Waste. Action. Draw a waste can. What objects or things do you define as waste? Waste can be anything, from garbage, opinions, or a waste of time. Your idea of waste could be different from someone else's. Questions for exploration. What have you filled your trash can with? Can anything in your trash can be recycled in any way? Can you change something about an item that you see as waste to make it usable? Pause this video and come back for our last activity of this series. For our last activity, I'm going to have you look into the past, the present, and the future. Past, present, future. Action. Think about this affirmation. The past is a lesson. The present is a gift. The future is your motivation. Draw a symbol related to a lesson you learned in the past. A gift you have in the present. This can be an everyday experience like a sunrise and a goal for the future. Questions for exploration. What textures, lines, colors, and shapes do you use to put in your symbols? Why? What drew you to depict these items? And that's it for our series. If you did any of the activities in these videos that you would like to share, tag me and the AGW on Instagram. I would love to see it. Bye.